morning guys it's 9 or 2 already in the morning and yeah i'm ready to send my mother to drop my mother and look to dialysis and while waiting for the time i'm watching big brother pinoy big brother you know oh, I'm, i have to get my key because before i forgot it or else i can get in the house because my husband is supposed to be here today I mean, he is off today. Excuse me. And <laughs> early in the morning, I'm still asleep. I hope my husband. I hope my husband's get home early. And I hope everything is okay with him. Some doctors, some office, doctor's office, they don't do the job right. I mean, I think it's really the patient's job to run around to get the thing. Huh? Ten minutes after I left that, I said, oh, yeah, we got your disc for you. But you couldn't give it to me when I left? My job to run and go back there because they didn't give it to me when I left and signed out. I guess they told me that they would get the ref they would get the referral, and when I get that, they said, "No, that's your responsibility." If they told me that, I would have brought it with me. I would have had to like now have to worry about whether they charge me a thousand dollars or not. What your signal is.
wind up sending me to the elevator, guys. There was no parking. And then my stomach, I feel like throwing up. My stomach is like my intestines going out. It feels like that way. This is a nice area here, no one. Look how convenient I made your life. I came back and picked you guys up. What? I made it back in time. Well, I'm ready to take a cab. I don't really expect you to be home early. No, I don't want to take a union cab. Why is that? Because... <coughs> I don't know. I don't know anybody in that company. I don't know how good the company is. Well, like, why do you know some Bluebird? Bluebird, yeah, Bluebird's been around for 100 years. We know. And you know the I good thing about the good thing about Bluebird is they know the area and they know the neighborhood who well, live you, there. Union Cab knows the area too. They're from Lincoln Avenue. It's not like they're. I know, but these people know about the who live in that house. You we know, grew up with. I don't know. I don't know anybody who works for Union Cab Company. They're pretty. They're pretty. They're relatively new. Uh, I think they I think they used to be Red Fox when we were younger, but I don't. I don't know for sure. They just popped out of nowhere. There is a new driver, huh? <coughs> no, there is a new driver from Florida, and Florida. I would use him. No, he's from Florida, and he's talking like he's Florida can't drive. Can he, he lived he lived here before and he came back for his mother. Okay. His mother is sick. So he likes Florida, he doesn't like old. Have, do you have few hours? It's like, you know, I, I thought he's talking to me like he wants me to uh, spend time with him. Uh, you know, that's what I thought. It's just like, and I said, yeah, why? I said, yeah, why? Question him. And he said, no, no, no. It's just like, do you have time to wait for, you know, mom's caregiver? And they said, yeah, I still have a few times. She, she stayed there for like three and a half hours at the dialysis. And yeah, I said, are you Filipina? And he said, yeah, I am. I said, how long you been here? It's like, you know, like, I said, oh, I've been in the Philippines. I know you are Filipina. I've been in the Philippines. I have, uh, I had a girlfriend before I was a Filipina. And I was in Cebu. She, she told me that everything. And yeah, and then I said, oh, so you don't have any family here? You, you live is the inn? And I, 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 I told him direct quick, yeah, I live with my husband. She is my mother-in-law. I said, oh, I don't know that. And then like, they're like, and then he shut up. <laughs> and then he shut up like. So you know where that was going? Yeah, because I know already. Like, I know he, he's like, he's trying. Yeah, he must have thought you were a whole health aide or something. Yeah, so he shut up. He stopped talking, really. <laughs> yeah, well, because he was going somewhere with it, and all of a sudden he just ended it. Yeah. He was making small talk so that he could, uh... Get me. Fuck up. <laughs> We're out again to shopping. It's not like it's a grocery shopping, it's not that just cat milk food and our food. Yeah, sale, filet mignon, 7 dollars What is that? Where, where is that? Filet mignon is supposed to be the best. I know, but what beef. store? It's two Leonard's. Where is it? It's up by uh, Central, Central Avenue. Central Avenue. 7 dollars a pound for, for filet mignon is a pretty good price. Really? Yeah. And they cut it any size you want. Where did you know that they have? Inside the flyer. Oh. And I guess it's a good idea. If it's on sale, but if it's not, then. And that's really, really tender beef. Really tender. That's 
That's nice. That's supposed to be the best steak you can have. I don't buy it. I like ribeyes better, but um, mostly because filet mignon is very small pieces. Yeah. And if you buy them pre-cut, they're like really small. But if you, they say they'll cut them in, in any way you want. So if you want it like this, it may be small, but it's you can make it really thick for you. Oh, really? First time I pointed okay. out to you, you didn't like it. And now every time you see it, you like it. It's nice, huh? And the first time, I, first time I pointed out to you, you said, oh, I really like the car. You said, yeah, I don't like it. No, it's a, no, it's huh? a different car oh, when you're every time you see something. Car. No. I like the car. The shape is like a... It's a Camaro. It's a, in the future, you know, Camaro. future car. Like a powerful one. Was, well, Camaro was. It was a hot rod. Because there's no such thing as a hot rod anymore. But Look at that. How pretty yeah. is that truck? I mean, it's not convertible, but... You can get it in convertible. Oh, really? Yeah, it comes in convertible. Not every car comes in convertible. You realize that, right? Not every car? No. Yeah. You can't just get any car in a convertible. I know. Jeep. Jeep, right? It's a watermelon. Huh? Dried beef? Tripe. Tripe? Why oh, don't need the tripe? My makeup right now, I'm using airbrush, Belito Studio brush. Her brush. And my lipstick is real long. <coughs> Our dinner tonight is salmon. The last time we went to Costco. The last time we went to Casco is my husband picked up some salmon. My husband cut it in pieces and I freeze some of, some of them. So now we have some salmon. Salmon is very expensive here. Oh, I think wherever you go, <clears throat> even in the Philippines. But they have malapinia, guys. If you know what is malapinia, you, that's really good too. And. And you can't eat a lot of malapinia because it's not good for your stomach. It makes you, it gives you the diarrhea. And after that, you after you eat malapinia, you have to drink a lot of water. <clears throat> My husband's watching Bones. I thought you were watching Supernatural before. Oh, that's on TV, not in a... My tongue is... It's something, I don't know. It's not burned, but... My box is ready to send. 
Absolutely. And hold on, guys. He gets this together. It's true. Yeah. He's awful like that. He reads people the way that you read the book. It's chocolate. Yeah. yeah. I know. I hate him. And more chocolate in that side. Yeah. And toys under it. Yeah. a few more stuff to put that they can just send it. Hello guys, good evening. Uh, I'll see you in my next video guys. Thank you for watching and please subscribe if you still don't subscribe. And thank you again and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye.